The freight trains that carry mining materials across the deserts of Western Australia are big, really big. The trains comprising of 240 wagons being hauled by up to three locos, they're over one and a half miles long. The trains cover large distances with a network over 900 miles of track. The trains previously had to carry multiple shifts of drivers and engineers with stops for changeovers en route and accommodation at turnarounds. Starting in 2019, Rio Tinto rolled out its auto haul system to its Western Australian network. After 10 years of development, computers now run the trains fully autonomously, with no remote controllers, all decisions are taken on board. The trains are packed full of safety sensors which are tested and configured before each trip. With the computer stopping the train in the event any issues are detected, they believe the trains may now be safer than when the drivers operated them before. The change seems to have worked, with the new trains operating at a more consistent pace across the long sectors. Drivers still take the trains to the first and last miles of their journeys, where they are most likely to encounter humans. The company is continuing to push the system on, with a test of a new collision avoidance system announced this week. Is it only a matter of time until automation becomes the norm?